China cautions Berlin against paying its costs to join an anti-China alliance. Several Chinese-paid, influential German media outlets have expressed concerns over the German Air Force's participation in exercise pitch black for the first time. Berlin has joined an anti-China alliance in the Indo-Pacific, which China has warned will negatively impact Berlin's commercial relations with Beijing in the long run. Chinese specialists are in a grave situation as the world turns against them. They view these sane opinions as reflecting the general idea of Germany's commercial and governmental leaders toward China. Although German Chancellor Olaf Scholz cautiously found a balance between superpowers, some experts claim that Germany's growing military presence in the Indo-Pacific revealed internal divisions within the German government and sent out a chaotic signal on its China policy. According to reports, Exercise Pitch Black began on Friday, a military exercise involving the U.S., Australia, and 15 other nations. The U.S. wanted to rally other countries to oppose Chinese bullying and demonstrate the unity of the West. According to a recent article in Germany's national daily newspaper Die Welt, the German Air Force, Luftwaffe, wants to show off its power in the Indo-Pacific region against China. The article noted that while this is honorable, Germany is not America, and a tumbling should not think himself as a giant. The Frankfurter Allgemeine Zeitung, another German media outlet, recently stated in an article that the Luftwaffe's trip to the Indo-Pacific indicates Germany's readiness for military engagement in what is likely the most crucial geopolitical region of the world. However, the newspaper also cautioned that Germany is too weak militarily and needs to rearm against the Russian and Chinese threats quickly. According to Ingo Gerhardt, the head of the German Air Force, the planes won't cross the Taiwan Strait and will barely touch the South China Sea. Voices in Europe are reiterating the assertions as the US views the emergence of Chinese bullying and violence as the most significant danger. For instance, according to Zhang, China was mentioned as a danger by German Foreign Minister Annalena Baerbock. China is attempting to rule Europe by dividing the continent. However, Berlin's China policy would differ significantly from Washington's because Berlin is aware of how critical it is to keep China as a key partner for Germany's strategic and economic interests, Zhang said. Despite political pressure on Berlin to turn away from Beijing, the German economy became more dependent on China in the first half of 2022, with direct investment and its trade deficit reaching new heights, according to Reuters on Friday, citing a study from the German Economic Institute. Although Gerhardt's was quoted in media reports as saying, I don't think we are sending any threatening message toward China by flying to an exercise in Australia. The German Air Force attempted to downplay the relationship between the military exercise and the U.S. strategy of containing China in the region. Conflicts between the German military and the government have existed since the final stages of the Merkel administration, creating an erratic signal. According to Kui, if Germany deliberately increases its influence in the Indo-Pacific area, it could put the nation in an unequal position. With the help of Western media outlets, the German Navy frigate Bayern traversed the South China Sea in December 2021, emphasizing that this was the first time a German warship had visited the South China Sea in the previous 20 years. Germany must consider additional issues, such as relations between China and Russia, the EU and Russia, and China's relations with its neighbors while adjusting its strategy toward China in light of the Ukraine situation. Previously, it exclusively considered China-US relations, according to Kui. According to past media sources, Germany is revising its approach to China and will announce the new stance sometime in 2023. Some experts also think that future Germany-China relations will emphasize some security concerns, seeking a new balance in a changing geopolitical environment, as opposed to its previous ties with China which were based on trade and commercial relationships. As bullying and hostility in China have increased, 